Well, you you just come into Lagos, you're like a Johnny just drop. And you're wondering, how do I survive in Lagos? There were tips on how to survive in Lagos. But do you have a survival kit of sorts that you would <laughs> hand out to your friends, your buddies, or family members? Anybody who's coming to Lagos and you're like, guy, you need this, you know, survival. Lagos survival kit. Mm. What would be the makeup of that Lagos survival kit? I want to know. So if you've been living in Lagos forever or you just moved to Lagos, how have you survived? How were you able to survive the madness? The Uber person that brought me today was telling me that, look, madam, you cannot, you, are, you look like a gentle lady. Mm -hmm. Gentleness does not work in these Lagos, you. <laughs> I they don't know you. Gentleness does not work. You have to be a weary. I'm Say like, what? <laughs> and you know me, I was trying to be posh. I'm like, oh God, you have to be calm. You know, you know, you, just, you don't need to fight. Say, ah, oh, whoa. <laughs> the way the man was saying it, I was just like, and he meant that you have to have a certain level of madness to be able to live in Lagos, to be able to survive in Lagos. I believe in, I believe in faith and patience. That's all I, I always tell my friends. Have patience, no matter what, you know. Hmm. I, come, I came to this Lagos in 2000, uh, 2001. And so, this Hey, my beautiful people. Good morning. Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. It's your girl, Faith Martins. Guys, how have you been? I, someone should please recommend all this um, car driving stand. I'll be camera driving stand for me because it's becoming something else. I cannot... I cannot always be holding my camera to film while driving how are you guys doing so today is friday and it's a rainy friday guys i woke up and it's been raining cat and dog since i woke up but i cannot stay at home all day doing nothing although we are working already at the at the office at the business place i have little things to do at the office but right now i want to go service my car this car is due for service and every time I'm saying I will service, I will service, I will service. I'm like, let me take it to my mechanic and service. Then, <laughs> can you imagine? I left some money at the bank only for me to see minus 600 naira in my account. I didn't even add money. I just realized that ah, this money that someone transferred to this account. I actually left it in this account for about three weeks now. Ha! <sighs> I said, okay, let me go check the account. I now saw minus 600. So now I'm going to the bank to know what has happened to my money. Hopefully, um, I will have a peaceful resolve at the bank and then head straight to service my car. I service my car far away in Aja. That's why they service it cheap for me and they service it well. So, it take me like another 45 minutes to get to Aja. Uh, Bob, we are here for it. That's what we signed up for when we tried to buy a car. <laughs> my people, I'll talk to you guys later. I just thought to start this vlog because this is the start of a new vlog. I just had to come here and start this vlog. <laughs> is it like this? You guys want me to be doing this three video under the rain? Not be small under this one or in the rain. I'll talk to you guys later. Day two. Hi, my people. Good afternoon. Today is, today is Saturday and I'm currently off to the vet. So my dogs are going for their vaccination. My dog is actually due for vaccination on the night, which is on Monday. Well, because I can't be going to the hospital, the vet hospital on Monday. I'm taking her earlier today. And oh, I forgot my earrings. And then my sister's pop was due for vaccination last week. When well, my sister was away and I tried, I, I was ill. No, I did travel. I was ill, so I couldn't take her. So I'm both, oh. so I'm taking both of them to the vet. Come on, relax. And from the vet, we are going, they will go have clean bath. See this dog, see, see how dirty she is. See Bella, how detangled, how tangled their hair is. They need to go detangle, half clean bath, the warm. Because I noticed that my dog, her meat I gave her since yesterday, she didn't even eat at all, even Bella, even Sika. I say hi to my camera. They didn't even eat at all yesterday, like yesterday night. And it's keeping my me worried because I'm the mama. If you don't eat, I'm going to be sick. So we're off to the vet. Say hi. Say hi. Come on. 
I'll see you guys when I I can't view, film at the vet place. I'll see you guys when I from there I'll get to the market. I'm cooking soup. So that so I had this agreement with a very important person that I'm gonna start cooking in my house. Yes. I'm gonna start cooking. My excuse was I didn't have a gen. So I told you guys and I'll I i do not know if I filmed that gen. Oh yeah, so I'll go back to your suit. So I got a gen and now I know that my freezer is always going to be cold as long as I'm in Lagos. So what's stopping me from cooking? And eating out is kinda of expensive. And your girl which broke 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 I need to I need some money, money, money. So right now I'll from the vet I might keep them with somebody at the market and then enter to shop because I can't come back home and be going back to the market. It's too stressful. Can you imagine my gate? Man is not the gate. So from there I'll go to the market, buy things for a goosey soup and ayamashi stew. Guys, if you see how things are expensive in Nigeria, see my estimates, see my list, my market list. I can't remember the last time I wrote a market list. I can't remember. See, see, see how much is the estimate? 19,650 for just soup and stew for a single lady. Imagine people that now have children. Although this soup and stew is supposed to last me like four or five four days yeah imagine people that not have children how they are why is my lip dry how they are struggling to feed even weekend food is costing me twenty thousand some people make like 40,000 40, a month so how do they feed every weekend it's up to god at the end of the day i'll see you guys later two hours later hi guys so i'm currently in the kitchen sorry there's no there's no light so everyone is running their chain. Three hours later. Hi guys. So I know I told you. Oh, I know I told you guys. Let me go change my clothes. But I ended up sleeping, guys. I'm super tired. Today is Saturday. I'm not supposed to be doing so all of this run around. Mentally, I'm still working because I'm still working with my boy. I'm still replying messages. I still have to create JID profile, but I'm very, very tired. I'll just keep that GIG on until my boy gets to the office. Please ignore every background noise. So I got, um, let me show you guys what I got. So this is all I got. This is um, Torel meat. I already put that in water before I slept off. This is um, intestine, roundabout, liver. I got this. This is a bowl of 5,000 era watts. This goat meat, 3,000. Goat lap. Everything is just. I think I'll just be buying all these online girls. I think it's better that they weigh and sell for you. Now I bought. I tend to shred this one tiny because I'm making ayamashi sauce as well. So this is green bell pepper for ayamashi sauce. This is green habanero pepper for ayamashi. And I'm gonna be using turkey and pomo as well. This pomo is for both ayamashi and. The soup and then I have eggs at the other side. Then this is a goosey grinded it, ehu, ohu or ehu, and opei and crayfish. And this crayfish I want to store. Then this is onugu. This is iru. Iru is going to be for the ayamashi. This smoked fish. I didn't buy stockfish because I have stockfish. Let me show you guys. But the last time my mom visited, she left this. This container of stockfish, I've never used it, so I'm going to use it today. And that's basically what I'm going to be doing today, right now. Once I'm done cooking, I will send out the deliveries I have at the office to send out. Then, the idea my boy would have gotten to GIG, will send out. Oh God, running a business is not easy, just, just, just need strength because the more money you make, the more. And I think there's a way, I don't know if there's a way I can outsource this part of my business that somebody handles and they just tell me how much I want to be involved so don't worry so first is first let me wash my meat this is my salt I'll put the salt so I did, did some level of washing at the market which makes it easier so here you just wash 
Det tror jag har blivit fint. I'm using one hand to walk and one hand to wash. When you marry an entrepreneur, you get ready for something. Well, no, I'm not really working. Why have you not got it to GIG? What's happening? Start going. When you get there, you let me know. Let me send you the code. What's happening? When you get there, first of all, you wait the item and send me the weight so I can send you the code. So if this thing wasn't properly like washed at the market, I'll have to be scraping the dirt off the towel. But it's been cleaned. To share this because of my amache sauce i'll remove the one i'll use for my soup and shred the remaining so i need to sharpen my knife if you need a knife sharpener i have it in my store i have for bulk purchase if you're doing souvenirs and i have the work for retail use for your personal use
guys before i shred the green pepper let me do a confession i'm actually doing this for myself for the first time hello nesto okay so guys before i go downstairs i'm actually making this ayamache sauce for the first time and i'm using gudu let me give kudos to the website i'm using I'm using my diaspora kitchen under the same of sauces and stew. So now I want to just I want to use this one to shred. You see it to shred the pepper, all of the peppers and the tomatoes. Oh, and the onion rather, peppers and onion. It's not a tomato stew. I think that the oil I bleached is not enough, so I might have to top up oil. But let me just allow it to cook and then press down. Let me make the oil be enough. Hi guys, so yeah, my house is a noisy place. Oh, I 
will not remain in. I didn't charge other batteries, so when I even switched, the thing wasn't working. So, so now I've put in the all the protein, the pomo, the intestine, goat meat, everything. I'm just gonna leave it to cook for two minutes while I bring out the um, maggi, salt, and all the good stuff. Guys, I cannot keep up, so I'll just film small. So guys, everything looks settled. I don't know if you the pepper, but now it's time to add the vegetable and I'm using bitter leaf in this case. I love my table with bitter leaf. So the bitter leaf has been washed, it has been boiled, and now I don't want so much because it's not vegetable soup. Neither is it bitter leaf soup. So guys, our food is ready. Oh my god, I'm so grateful to everyone that has watched from the beginning. I am so grateful. I don't know what the caption is, but I'm cooking for myself. So this is our egg. I got this fruit at the market. Very, very, very cheap. This is our ayam chasing stew. Egg we put inside. And I just filmed the Plating and I'll put it back inside the freezer for you guys. Hi, so our uh, soup is ready and the water for my oatmeal swallow is boiling. I'll see you guys when everything is set. I love you. Mwah. Guys, so the food is ready. This is my ayamashi sauce, my egg goosey soup. Yep, thumbs up if you like this. Like, share, subscribe, and do see you guys in another video. Bye.